Hello and welcome back, Radar Force. <laughs> I know it's been a long time and you're probably wondering where the heck I've been, but uh, I have been doing stuff. I have been doing stuff. Unfortunately, I have not been doing stuff for the channel, so that is shame on me. Shame on me. Uh, but if you guys want to know what I've been up to, um, I'll, I will probably make an update video on where the heck I've been in the past four months. Uh, but to keep things short, I've, I've been playing a lot of Halo because that game came out, Halo Infinite. And then I've also been kind of uh, digging deep on retro gaming with TVs and old consoles and all that good stuff. So, yeah, I've been doing that. And uh, since I finished my collection, I've kind of like took a backseat on a lot of things. And uh, I've been inspired to make this video because a new release has finally came out for Dragon Ball Z. Other than uh, Dragon Ball Super Manga and stuff like that. I could update you on that, but I'm sure everybody knows that the manga is still coming out every two or three months. But this one, I believe, snuck past a lot of people. And uh, what I am talking about is what I'm going to call it. I'm going to go ahead and call it the uh, Dragon Ball Z Orange Brick uh, Blu-ray versions. These are literally uh, Orange Bricks for Dragon Ball Z Blu-ray. Uh, Walmart released uh, an exclusive Walmart... They, they released an exclusive Walmart Dragon Ball Z... Uh, Blu-ray seasons one through three, four through six, and seven through nine in a box set. For for what I can only describe as a Blu-ray counterpart to the Orange Bricks. So here is seasons one through three, uh, and then is in a box set. I'm not going to open mine because I see no point. Bum bum bum. I believe these snuck past a lot of people because I honestly didn't know until my buddy that follows Funimation and all that like released a video saying. Well, not released a video, released a, a post saying that these were coming out. I knew about these for like two months ago. I've been keeping them in my back pocket. Um, anyways, they finally came out, and I was, I got them yesterday. Uh, they are about 35 bucks a box set, which is actually pretty good, considering these still books are 30 or the same price for one season. But uh, th these are just going to be laughed at because these are not 4x3. They were not the remasters. To my knowledge, these are just the 16 by 9. Well, I know they're 16 by 9, but uh, I'm, I'm almost 100% sure they are the same as the blue original Blu-ray sets that Funimation released that had the cover art making a, a image. I'll show them on screen right now. I don't have them with me, but they they released. It's I, I think it's just a re-release of that is all I can figure. Uh, but it is a box set, seasons one through three, as you can see, only at Walmart. Uh, and this is what makes me call them the Orange Bricks but Blu-ray versions because that is an orange brick. Uh, I still think it's sick. I know a lot of people hate the orange bricks and all that, but I think it's cool that we have a Blu-ray counterpart now. It's pretty pretty daggone sick. Uh, but seasons one through three, here's the back. A Super Saiyan emerges. Uh, and I, I, I don't know if you guys watch the special features or anything, but it, it could be, it's probably the same interviews that have been in all of them. Uh, let me know if that is correct or not. Also, you can see right here, it says 1080p, at 16 by 9 ratio so it has to be the same release of the blu-rays that we got in like 2010 uh, now these do come with different uh, cover art and all these I'm not gonna open mine up so you probably have to wait for somebody to do a, a different review I'm not gonna open these up I see no point uh, but I will put images on screen of what the individual case covers look like I see no point in opening them up since I'll probably never watch it I do think the artwork is sick as crap but with that said we are gonna move on to seasons four through six and it is cool that we're getting some kind of fresh new art which i know this has been replicated a million times but it is a little different i guess uh seasons four through six uh spine art orange brick it'd be cool if they released these like individually seasons one through nine but then it'd be super thin and it would not look like an orange brick but uh, nonetheless, I do love the fact that it looks like an orange brick. It's just, it's a freaking meme at this point. Like, really. Uh, here's the back. Goku must save the future. Once again, it is 16 by 9 at 1080p. Uh, feel free to... I, I don't know who the freak packaged mine. It, this is the only reason I want to open mine up is to flip this back. Right, like that. It's upsetting that this one's upside down. Luckily, I won't be displaying it like this. I'll probably be displaying it with the orange brick spine beside my orange bricks also i didn't show on the last one but the top one just 
says Dragon Ball Z. The bottom one just says Dragon Ball Z. Look at there. On to the final uh, season part three, which is um, seasons seven through nine. Super Saiyan three, Goku on the front, looking sick. I do, I do like this one. Probably my favorite uh, spine. We get the beautiful orange brick spine. I love it. Even though like it's something to hate on, but I love it. The fate of the universe hangs in the balance. And then again, uh, we have a 1080p 16 by 9. No 4 by 3, no remaster. Um, but yeah, I, I do think a lot of, uh, I do think they snuck past a lot of people. Because I haven't heard anybody talking about this. Um, and I have nobody contacted me about it either. Except one of my friends that keeps up with Funimation and just told me, hey, there's a new release coming out. Uh, but yeah, I pre-ordered these two months ago. I really don't know how many people know about them, but I'm going to educate you guys on this so you can keep up with your collection um, and all that. And just for the meme's sake, I'm going to try to get these three in there. That's as good as I'm going to be able to make it, I think. Sick. That looks sick, man. I, I adore that. But, you know, everybody's been waiting for the freaking orange brick spines. And I wish I had the orange bricks with me right now so I could make a meme out of that, too. I mean, they... I just, I don't know, man. I'm a fan of the orange brick colors. But, and I've always wanted a Blu-ray set. So there you go. We have the uh, Blu-ray counterpart of the orange bricks. Unfortunately, it's not, it's only three box sets, but that's good. Uh, with the price of these, man, $33 for three seasons, $35 for three seasons. That's not bad, but the fact that it's not the remastered ones that just came out, what, a year and a half ago or two years ago? Uh, it is it is kind of stupid, like why they keep re-releasing these same bull crap. But then again, you got dumb people like me that are gonna buy any release that they throw out at you. So there you go. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. That means a lot. Uh, I do want to make more videos for you guys. I do plan on coming back. But when I come back, which I obviously I'm back, but I'm gonna it's gonna be more of a slower pace, and I want my videos to be more in depth and also. When I post, I want them to be finished instead of rushed, if that makes any sense. I want to have better content instead of just rushing to, to throw a video out there. But until then, guys, uh, take care. And uh, like I said, if you want to see like the individual Blu-ray inside here, you probably have to look up somewhere else. I can't find them online anywhere, so I will throw the pictures up from the stock photos. But other than that, I'm not going to open mine up because I want to keep mine in mint condition. I see no point in opening them and watching them. But anyways, guys, you take care. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out and take care.